Hello and welcome to Symantec's video tutorials. Today we will be demonstrating how to download an SSL certificate from the Symantec Trust Center. Let's begin from a web browser and go to symantec.com forward slash SSL. Off to the menu on the right, click the My Account Sign In link. Under the Symantec Trust Center section, click the Account Sign-In button. Enter the username and password for your account. Then click the Sign-In button. Once inside your account, Select the certificate you wish to download from the certificate list. Verify the order number, as well as the validity dates to ensure that the correct certificate is being selected to download. When verified, click the download certificate link. Under the section Manual Installation, click the Download Certificate button. Here you are presented with the SSL certificate. First, select the format of the certificate depending on which server platform the SSL certificate will be installed to. The PKCS7 format is typically used for Microsoft platforms and is a single certificate file that contains the intermediate CA chaining certificates along with the SSL. The X509 format is used for all other platforms. With the X509 format, you will be presented with multiple certificates. The end entity is your issued SSL certificate, while the remaining are the intermediate CA chaining certificates that are also required to be installed on the server. Once you have chosen which format you want to use, copy and paste the context, including the header begin certificate and footer end certificate, to a plain text editor application like Notepad on Microsoft or VI on Linux platforms. When saving the SSL certificate file, if using the PKCS7 format, you will save the file as a .p7b extension. If using the X509 format, the file extension is dependent on your server platform. In most cases, it will be a .cer or .crt extension. However, please check with your server vendor as to what file extension should be used. That's it. Thank you for watching Semantics video tutorials. For further support and troubleshooting, please feel free to visit our support pages at symantec.com forward slash help.